That's right. And next, hoping to win your votes, is Darba Gadame and his partner, Nadia Bishkova. <laughs> Last week, they wowed all of us with their amazing cha-cha, and tonight they're doing a quick step that's set in a library. And we're all looking forward to the next chapter in Darvard's Strictly story. So how was it for you, Saturday night, our first dance? It was good. From the very beginning, you were leading her. I'm hoping that's a great kind of starting point for some of the other dances we do as well. Because I think any woman would feel safe in your arms. What we wanted from the beginning with this dance was to the, the man led. I'm happy they mentioned it. Yeah, it was a great feeling. That was the really? high, the highest. highest. Yeah. True. We can beat yes. that this week. We have feel to. Feel even higher. The quick step is going to be quite difficult because it's actually quite fast but very elegant. So it's going to be interesting to see if I can do both those things at the same time. The story of the dance. Just imagine us being in a library. we bumping into each other. And then we dance yeah. in a library. So we're going to go to an actual library just to get the feel of the place. Student Darvard's off to the library to swat up on the quick step then. Or is he? The last time I was in a library, I probably wasn't uh, the best behaved. Well, I think Nadia's taken a leaf out of your book. <laughs> Oh. Yellow. Shh. Shh. I'll race you, okay? Good. Okay. David, what are you doing? Some little read up on the quick step. The best way to study quick step is to practice. Let's go. If you do like this on Saturday night, we will book ourselves a place in competition next week. <laughs> Very good. Dancing the Quick Step, David Gadami and Nadia Bishkova. into this like a duck to water, haven't you, this dancing lot? Bruno, you loved his confidence last week. Look at that face. What does it mean? <laughs> Talk uh -huh. to us, Bruno. You see, you're, stu you're not stuck for words, because this uh, is a I'm definitely not. I'm stuck for something, but it's not words. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, that was the, the fast and furious of ballroom. <laughs> that was a race straight to the bedroom. I'm telling you. <laughs> well, but that was the story. Yeah, and yeah. I mean, you got what you wanted, didn't you? <laughs> It's rough at times, but you get to it. And that is the point of the old criticism. I think I love your passion. I mean, I'm all about it. And keep that going. I love your chemistry. But quick, quick step has to have an element of elegance to it. And when you're so rough, you know what I mean? You tend to lose it a bit. But great dance, just if you use a quick step, bring a little bit more elegance into it. I like everything else. Great. Head lash a little flow, a little bit of style. Uh, there was an illegal lift in there that you didn't need to do, but I understand why you did it. But I thought the energy was absolutely incredible. Standard, wasn't it? very impressive, very difficult quick step. I mean, it was light, it was spirited, everything was there. Just watch that energy, doesn't go into the upper body. It's got to be 
totally calm. I don't want to see any of that. It all goes into that fast footwork. But very impressive. Very good. Is he still your leading man, Shirley? Well, again, I'm going to say I am a little bit of a traditionalist, and you know that I really enjoyed your performance last week, and I told you it was lovely to feel safe in your arms, but I didn't get today. So much messing about, too much time before you actually got going with the quick step. We had an illegal lift, we had drops in the middle. Why not stick? The quick step is already a bright dance. It's a technical dance, it's a flight, it's got flow. Why? You're a dancer, you could be a front runner. I mean, have the man dance. I mean, that's how I see it. I'm sorry. Sure, it was dancing. Oh, the dance was fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, ladies and gents? Did you enjoy it? Yeah! yeah. We all loved it. Well done, lovely job, David and Nadia. Yeah. Fantastic. Well done. You have never danced before. No. Are you sure? Definitely. Okay, I just said that. last week. Okay. <laughs> uh, but you are hard on yourself. You're like Gemma. I was saying to Gemma as well, like, you're just, you're going, no, let me do it again, let me do yeah, it again. Yeah, I'm quite, I'm quite, I, I want to, I don't want her to have to tell me off. I want to be able to tell myself off. So. Okay. Yes. Yeah, she hasn't yet. Okay, good. No, you did great. Scores are in. Will the judges please reveal their scores? Craig Revel Horwood. Six. Darcy Buster. Seven. Shirley Ballas. Seven. Bruno Tom Young. Seven. Are you happy with that? Yeah, You're too happy disappointed. With that. That's no, exactly no, the no, same no, no. score. Same as last. Well, yeah, yeah, but you did great. If you enjoyed David and Nadia's quick step and want to see them dance again next week, please vote. All the details are on your screen now. Voting will open very soon because we have just one couple left. <laughs> to... I know. Uh, you'll find out soon, Pasha. <laughs> Tess. <laughs>